Oh, and I wake up at the foot of the bed. Wow. I never get in bed from the foot of the bed. It just feels wrong to me. Oh, okay. Uh, spoils of the land. Okay, great. Uh, I think I'm out of TV at this point. Yep. I think, I think I'm literally out of TV. Weather. I almost feel like the weather gave up on being various at this point, too. Hard to say. We'll find out. Oh, well, it's official. The campaign is closed and we reached four times our original goal. That's blowing my mind. I'm running out of words to explain how I feel. We're starting construction on the Founders Hall as soon as possible. We'll have an opening party and everything. I'll come get you on the day of the grand opening. Don't bother. I don't actually care. Okay, we'll have that in a moment. There's your daisies. I'll ship the ones with stars for the sake of the quest, which I assume that they impact the quest. I don't actually know. They're actually, this is not good money until I pick star surplus, baby. <laughs> yeah. They'll have to, uh, they can do the pick star without me. It's just like how I actually handle the kick star. I guess I, I I took the I took the reward at the end, but not the uh, I don't know. I, I played enough already. Although in my defense, I the alpha got got access to the alpha and it immediately moved pretty much. So okay, so. Cucumbers, we can actually potentially get more out of here. So that's the one thing that's left. I don't know about these cauliflower. I think some of these might be because of wild seed problem. I'm not sure. I'm surprised these aren't. Uh, did I, I must have. I might have taken a gamble on some of these. We'll see if these work out. I was hoping that they thought day one was the same day I thought it was. I think that's the gamble. Oh come on! Why are you gonna do me like that? Is a debt to myself, kind of. Okay, I'm gonna ship the ones of stars. I'm gonna ship that. that, that. Okay, and then we're gonna go get uh, we're gonna go get some copper. Yeah, I might go all the way tonight. Okay, then we're gonna go. Mm. Yeah, let's mine last because uh, that's not time since the although daisies. Mm. Yeah, let's go mine first, actually. Because I don't even need to... I don't even need to smelt the copper, you know? I just need I just need literal copper. The faster I can get daisies going, the faster I can sell some. I did... Oh, uh, I did? Or did I go back to it? Did I still miss it after I went back? That's probably why... Uh... This cough... <laughs> I wonder how many times I just missed them. There's one way that they are hard to notice. It's when there's like the left and the right one are watered, but it's like it. Yeah. Oh my god. Well, I'll go back to place some beehives, so maybe I'll run that up. I won't go to the lab, but I think I need to prioritize this because I can still go to the lab tomorrow. I, I think. I'm unlucky today. I just need raw copper. The more the merrier. I get to I guess if I can get to ten I'll go for that today too. Just ignore the monsters. Need to speed run this up. Okay, I need to kill that monster though. It's not fair! It shouldn't be able to attack me. Oh I could have gone. Oh, I can't. It started to let me go that way. Oh my god. Freaking Kobe. Are you dead now? Thank you. Double, 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 triple, quadruple, or holy cow. Holy cow. I refuse. I, the crops are deep. Oh, okay. We're. Is 
things don't seem to attack really. Or does that hurt me when that blows up? Oh, I'm using a sickle for some. Oh, I don't need the. Why did they squirt out? Nah, I guess that makes sense actually, but I don't know if that's how they intended it, but it makes sense. I, I'm not mad at it, really. Okay, Jesus, it takes forever to get. Slimes are deadly. I'm not messing around. Okay, we got good copper. Nice. Probably I'll make four beehives at least. I need to stop killing them unnecessarily. Just slow me down. We can do that later. We can ruthlessly murder things for fun later on. So as a good farmer would love to do. Imagine just being like one day, I'm so bored with my life. I'm gonna go drop serious amounts of money on farmland. We're not talking about a little bit of money. I mean, farmland is expensive. If they have enough that you can actually live, like you can't just get an acre, and I mean, you can, I guess, but you don't just get an acre, plant some corn or whatever you want, and profit. Because even if you plant a little bit, you still need tractors and, and equipment and you're gonna have fuel costs, you're gonna have planting costs. You know? You don't just go, up, I'm gonna go farm today. You have to have, I mean, you can take a loan, right? You can get loans on that, on that kind of land, of course, but. I mean, it'd take a while to start making money off of it. So, I, I'd be surprised if there's a lot of people who don't have some sort of connection or reason to do such a thing. I just say one day I'm gonna go become a farmer, like, like it happens in, like Stardew Valley makes sense, right? Because in Stardew Valley, your grandpa owns a farm, you you already own the property, it's your inheritance literally. That makes sense, right? In that situation, one of two things happen, right? Grandpa owns a farm, either you sell the property to another farmer, probably, maybe something else, or or you farm it, right? Or you or another family member farms. It. So have enough to live and have enough to start farming. You don't just make money. Every, yeah, yeah, exactly. Like your income is not like. You know, uh, so like, but to make enough to live, I mean, man, to think. Okay, wait. We may have to take this one. Hey, there's a. I do not know what these are. Open. Oh, it's a chest. No, wait, did I get things out of the other chest when I opened this? All I got was slime blue. From that. Let's see if there's anything good down here. I to actually make money on a farm, I mean, it would be long after, oh my god, this would take, I'm going to go ahead and mine the, the more the merrier, so. I'm going to take the easy floor access and make the most out of it. Jesus. This is like those one rooms and on the like level 19s and stuff, on the, I guess the 9s. Or it's like the every other nine in Stardew Valley or something like that. Or maybe it's just the nines, I can't remember. This looks like it's supposed to be like a lock or a key or something. Yeah, but... Yeah, yeah, I mean, that that's where it makes sense, where it's like my family farm maybe i don't take over the family farm but i already have knowledge i might have some equipment i might have i have connections you know i just think if you even if you have a dairy farmer or if you're just a dairy farmer right i mean not just a dairy I mean, it's not like it's a it's a, not like it's a joke but you you gotta have pasture land you gotta have barns you gotta have equipment still you need to have vet connections you need to know where to buy cattle you need i mean it's nuts like i mean it's not like in this game, these games are like, like in the other one, it makes sense, right? And even in that situation where you're like, okay, your family owns it, but your family's not giving you their farm, they're not dead or whatever, like, okay, you can go both buy land, but you have connections, you know how it, how it works. Maybe you have some money. Grandpa helps you out, I don't know, stuff like that. And it's common for people who are, far, not, not super common, I guess, but it's not her for like farmhands to be like, 
you know, I really like this and I think I'm good at it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a stab at it. That that happens, right? But uh, but then again, they they have connections now. I mean, not that it's like, I mean, it's not like corporate America, but the connections are still almost maybe more important, right? Like, because otherwise you're just stuck in on your own. Uh, okay, uh, is this lab, how, how late is the lab open? Closed, oh, okay, it's closed today. I'm glad I didn't do that instead. <laughs> uh, okay, before, let's build the beehive that we can build first. 30 wood, Jesus. I should get anything I can, can in right away. I'm gonna start compressing these more, I guess. Yeah, oh yeah, that's pretty con. I mean, there's a lot of, like, I grew up with a few farmers who, th th their family was making serious money. I mean, you can make serious money. In, uh, I mean, the most well-off kid in my school growing up, which was in a farming community, of course. Little, little town. Uh, the most well-off family was a guy who owned a, lots of farmland, basically. Uh, and actually, the and that's the school. The most, the most well off. That, uh, oh, there's a bunch of not watered. What the heck? The most well off family is uh, like in the town, not in the school, I guess. Like I was talking about, like kids aren't to school with, but like most well off family in the town, they uh, was basically a farm land seller like uh he, he wasn't a farmer he just sold and <laughs> managed farmland which uh is has serious profit ability <laughs> as i learned i mean holy cow that dude was i mean he, he was the first person i knew that was like i mean my grandpa was a surgeon and had a good amount of money but he he's the first person i Knew other than my grandpa, who I could say is was like rich, like yeah. I mean, and, and yeah, basically he was in property real estate, and he dealt in large property real estate, like exclusively. Like he he sold land, like it wasn't just farmland, but uh, but the big thing, the way he made his money was managing and selling land to farmers but like well, the town i grew up in or, or lived in most of my childhood at least uh he made his money or he had a, a huge like i don't know it was like a 40 acre parcel of land that he sold to the the, town, the city i say but you know it's like a town of literally 2000 he sold to the the city and managed it and they built like nice houses for the you know higher end houses really nice houses and dude he had to have i know he made crazy money managing that so like you know he was selling property to like towns and stuff <laughs> what the heck how do you get in how do you get into that <laughs> he was a member of the church he uh single-handedly kept most of the people in the church that ever got paid paid <laughs> like he could he could almost single handedly most of the time take responsibility for me ever having food <laughs> which uh, yeah used for making all kinds of oil hmm petroleum cool Let's try it out Let's get some. i'm getting rehearsing for new zealand petrol That guy made serious money. That's what I need to get to, into. I need to go, let's like, you know, start selling some land. I need to get some land first, but I just, I'm not going to worry about that part. I'm just going to go start selling some people's land. <laughs> like, it's, it's great land. It's for sale now. Uh, I was thinking it wouldn't be. No. That's weird. Okay, we got some serious, serious honey. The, now, I hate how I spaced these out now, because now I'm stuck. Let's get enough wood for two more of these things. Okay, now we're we're gonna have honey coming in at a pretty good rate, I think. Uh, let's eat. I want to get all this down just for a little bit more honey. 
pick one tree might be enough. I'm not sure how much wood the trees give there. But I did know at least I mean there are other farmers in the area too. I could think of actually like three different family three family names where they had pretty big farms, but the the one guy had a really, really big farm. Um Uh, okay, I did it. Is that enough? Okay, let's see. Uh, no. <laughs> uh, can I? Yes, yeah, Well, it's not like I don't have more. I don't know why. Time to ration my candy. I might need it later. I might need it. Stump enough. Yeah. We well, might as well cut down another tree while we're here. But yeah, I mean, to be like in Coral Island, there, there's no implication that this is Grandpa's farm. Right? They, they actually specifically imply that you just came and bought land, right? They do, they really do. Because uh, there's no mention of Grandpa. They're like, you came here earlier to check out the land. Like, I literally came and checked out the land and thought, you know what? I'm going to be a farmer. I would really like to know how often that happens. I don't know. Maybe future farmers of America would have. There might be a statistic on that. I don't know. I can't imagine. But, but you never know. Some people just like to make statistics about things. I like to read statistics. So somebody's got to like to make it, right? Why am I doing it all down the sign? That's just how it'd be. Can I? Oh. The stamina seems to think an inconsistent. Seems to happen inconsistently. Yeah, that's the right word in there. Okay. Uh, we got some serious beehives. I'd like to break these and move them, but the ones that are down, they're just down for life. I'm not going to stop using them, so they're just going to be forever uneven, I guess. Um, this is like the wine of Stardew Valley. Or the wine of this game, I guess. I assume there is wine that don't this game because there's a keg, so that might still be super profitable. Um, okay, there's all that. I'm gonna put this in here and we can worry about it later. We'll just be doing daisies for days at this point. That's gonna be some serious cash when it comes in. You know what this land already has a couple of uh, Yeah, it will be interesting to see the wine process because the honey's already nuts. I mean, when I actually sell stacks of honey, it's going to be great. I mean, look, I mean, nine cauliflower, these two almost kept up with that. Did I, fly, did I water everything? Now, here's a question. Do we go ahead and sickle stuff or not? Is it raining? What's that sound? Yeah, but now fairy honey could make a serious amount of that, but the, it's just the beehives are so much material in Surrey Valley. I say house is not, I feel like they are anyway. Oh, these ones are so cheap. I could have never made this many beehives at this point in Surrey Valley. I say house is not home until you can cook any joke and I can upgrade your house and add a nice kitchen just when you're ready. I'd rather just make money right now. Not any kitchens, cheap kitchens. Okay, well, I did not plan that cough. I think that was a wild seed cough bar. Hello, sir. What's up? Okay, I'm good. Yeah, thank you. I made Korean tacos, not Korean barbecue. Love you. Why are you creepy? Well. I don't always look at <laughs> Huh? Did you use Discord? Oh, I don't even have Discord open. Well, I have do not disturb mode on Discord. Oh my god, I, I literally, you finally did the thing and I, there's no way, you'd have to, you basically have to call me at this point. <laughs> no. Rude. Jessica, that's a good girl. 
Uh, okay. Um, why, why am I, why water the cucumbers? What am I doing? I guess I'm going to sickle these because I don't want to, uh, where is it? Really? That's it. I guess that's how it is in Stardew Valley until they wither. I'm going to clear the field so it's one less thing I have to worry about tomorrow. Like that will not be helpful to be worrying about this part tomorrow. I'm gonna go get some chickens though. I should be able to fill up on chickens, I think. Let's see if we can. Uh... Man, not worry about anything, huh? I might go mine a little bit more. We'll see. Do I have to let the cows out every day? That's, that's a little bit annoying. Come on out, cows. Oh, they're adults already. Okay, okay. Definitely get the baby cows then, because... What the heck? <laughs> already adults? Can I milk them already? Baby cow. Why would you not get baby cows? What? That was like three days or something? Two days? Three days? Depending on how much milk is, that might have just... Yeah, because unless milk... Because we're talking about 1250 versus 2500. And it, it's acting like they're milkable. So the only way it's not, the only way you shouldn't get baby is if one cow in three days can give you $1,250 worth of milk. So let's, let's do some science here. I bet you can sell this to the store, so I can, I can figure this out right now. I bet it's because of the store. Ooh, nice. Get some chickens. Fast growth. Yeah, I think that was three days. I think it was three days. Um, even four. Like, like we'll see. The math might. It might not even it. Nah, the difference between three and four days. How you doing, Jack? I think I'll take a nap for a bit after you leave. Well, you're a slacker. Okay, what's our chickens' names? Bruce egg. I'm definitely going with the baby chicken because I can get literally for the price of two, I can get all four. Select building. What you got for me? Okay, we're going in alphabetic order. Is that, is that, is that what? Do, what kind of F? E E Eleanor. We, we we didn't do E yet, did we? Eleanor. Agnes. Oh, are we resetting? Okay, great. <laughs> Sounds great. Nope, no, too late. <laughs> did we do an E name? We shouldn't have done an E name. I just did Agnes. You can rename him, I guess. So, Eleanor would have been good, huh? Okay, all right. I'll go back and I'll call the, the one chicken Eleanor or something. Bet. Okay, okay. We're starting over. Okay, that's fine. We're keeping our... Okay. We have our coop, our coop animals and we have the barn animals. Like, okay. Um, what do we got now? Uh, Cynthia. That doesn't seem like a. It doesn't seem like a chicken name though. Right. Uh, Carla. I'm not good at this. Carla seems like a cow name. Carry. Carry. It's like, carry me away, because I'm a chicken who can get killed easily by animals that can carry me away. Got eagle coming to mess up your chickens. All right, we're calling it Carry with a C, but Carry has a K. Carol? Did I name it one of my other things, Carol? Hang on, let's scroll through. Did we name one of the cows, Carol? Cass, okay, great. Carol. I don't know if that's how you spell Carol. It's not like a good way to spell Carol to me. What's our D name? Darla. Darla the Darla the chicken. Dory? No, that's a fish name. 
I'll name a I'll name a duck Dory. Cause okay. Alright. That's true. I'm okay, I'm not gonna go that way because that's feels like a shortcut, but it's not. I want that alpaca. I feel like that's a spoiler. I feel like they shouldn't show you animals you can't have yet. I want to go for science. Uh, wait, do I have the essence? I do. We'll go upgrade the crops first. So let's see. Let's see how much milk is worth. Because is getting one cow. Is God damn, they open later today. I don't know why that is. Oh God, do does there is there a church here like Yoba or something like that? Well, they open it. Remember to put on your sunscreen. Okay. I see more and more people outdoors now that the weather is a little again. Hmm. Not your little again. Okay, let's upgrade our produce quality. Okay, well I guess I'm definitely doing this because I can't afford the other ones. Where? How do you get hay? Like, well, besides buying it. That definitely simplifies that, doesn't it? Two days to upgrade. Crap. Ah, I should have prioritized this. The upgrade seat. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think so. I think it is a little bit off. crap so does that mean the seeds that i grow do i need to wait to buy seeds because it'll be higher quality or will it is it just affecting the i feel like what that lab is affecting is the overall quality of crops in the island i could be wrong but so i feel like if i any like instantly the chance of crops being higher quality will be higher and even if that's not their intention i feel like that's how it works currently probably and i'm just gonna live my life Betting on that. I'm just running around right now. Temp oh, temple. Yeah, of course. Temple. Wait, what is this? Someone's house. I want to go in there and look at that gaming setup. It's not gaming. She's working, I guess. Huh? What they call working. When you see a chart like that. What is she doing? She just has a chart in front of her like that. Yeah. What is she doing? <laughs> Looking at some metrics or something. Is she like a a day trader? Is she a day trader? I guess she could be. That looks like someone who's doing day trading to me. Kinda. I want a day trade, but you need serious time to do that. And I have whatever the opposite of that is. $75 a pop. So let's just think about this here. If you buy a cow that's an adult and you buy a baby cow, right? You buy an adult cow to skip the three days of baby cow, right? That baby cow only makes you in that time $225, right? So, and even if, even if I'm wrong, it was four days, $300. It's a difference of $1,250. So that, there is literally no reason not to buy the baby cow. That you would be dumb to not buy the baby cow. Yeah, I'm just gonna sell it here, let me. Let me keep that violet. I think I'll hit a money and honey slump probably at some point in the summer. Sam always makes sure we only use the best ingredients. Well, good. He believes that people can taste quality, and I kind of agree with him on that. Well, of course, again. Sam's a great boss. He may seem off putting at first, but he's actually really kind. He is direct, though, yeah. Is there. I have two. Jesus. Give me, give me things. Do we have. No. Go to the blacksmith, and I'm gonna go get copper, I guess. One with just one cow, you don't make your money back in one season. Oh, with two big cows, you make fourteen hundred dollars profit in one season. Is that true? Wait.
Yeah, because that's... Yeah, yeah, I guess so. 75 to 20, 20, 100, one cow. So it, you don't even... if you, So if you buy a adult cow... Because what was the one cow? It was 2,500? So if you buy an adult cow, you don't break easy. Eh, they're close, are you kidding me? Are they close all day? God dang it. If you buy an adult cow, it takes more than a season to break even. If you buy a baby cow, you break, you barely, you break, well, you break even by more than, by almost a thousand. Right? By, was $700, I guess, for one cow? Which, is, oh, okay, so, which, for the cost of one cow, so if you buy one cow, you will, it will take more than a season to break even. But for the same price, you can buy two baby cows and make $1,400 net profit in one season. So, yeah, they should fix that. <laughs> Holy cow. Yeah, okay. So, either way. Okay, $1,100 in net profit. So, I mean, not that there's necessarily something wrong with I assume the adult cow's like... You're one to unlock something and you want it freaking now. Okay, I'm gonna buy this because I missed them. Green tea. Can I actually buy that? Because uh, I, I had a coconut and I shipped it or gave it away to somebody and now I can't uh, find them anymore. What's that? Oh, it's the sun. I don't even know what the sun is anymore. It's how long I've been a night worker. I don't know if you can call it a night working when you go in at six anymore. Oh. Yeah, quick growth cows, yeah. Like, I, I don't mind that. And if that's what they want to do, then they should leave that. Maybe their intention is if you have the, uh, if you have the big cows, you know, you're getting the big cows because you just want the milk now. And you're not willing to wait. You know, maybe it's a luxury thing. But if they wanted to balance it, it should be like the baby cows are cheaper, but they don't produce milk for like, it'd have to be like two weeks though. They were definitely giving growth hormones. One of them gave me high quality milk already even, man. Like, well, bronze quality, not high quality, but. That's, uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure the deeper you go is better for copper right now. It's not looking good. The homes in here. See many copper veins out there. The fly's eyes look like cherries. Like the cherries are in the game. It bugs me. Hmm. Look at that. I'm hungry. It's like a free soup. I love it. It's not about three games. You can be hungry, but you just still sit here. Hey, oh. I don't think I have time to go all the way down now, especially if the rooms are going to be this big. Well, apparently I'm going to find holes on accident. Ooh, hello. Oh, I just like super sand through that. Oh, they're coming. They're coming. Oh, Lord, they're coming. The first time I've been like brutally attacked like that spider fur. Okay. Why don't they just show that picture on the floor? If they don't have a image ready. Yeah, I think like I have every word you just described. If you're gaming, you will be hungry, thirsty, and have to use the bathroom and just keep playing. Those are all true currently. And here I am. For like the last three days, too. I mean, I'm thirsty. I'm psychotically thirsty because my drink ran out and I'm like instantly. And I like, I need to have like water by me. Usually I bring a, a soda. Like, if I'm gonna have a soda, I bring water tea. Like, I just always fill up my water when I go get a drink. I did not. I regret it. I have regrets. Yeah, we just keep playing. Just get in the zone. This is why people will say hydrate. This is why you hear about 
people dying because they played video games, you know? Like the old stories of kid dies playing WoW for his whole life. Or whatever. Remember those? Kind of sad, but funny too. Do you remember that? You would literally hear about kid died while playing. They just get so into the game, they get. That's why I focus on the family that don't like WoW. Well. I played RuneScape, but focus on the family that didn't know about it. <laughs> Yeah, it's just sitting for 36 hours, like... So you get, I mean, you get DVTs and stuff, man. I mean, you could also I you just die of thirst and stuff, I'm not sure, but, like, you get DVTs too, like, I mean, especially as you get older, like, if you sit and play games all day, you throw a clot, man. You mess yourself up. You gotta be careful, you gotta, like, get off the computer, huh? That's what my body's saying to me right now. Get off the bloody computer. I'm like, dude, I ain't been here that long. But I sat at work a lot today, which is very unusual. I'm used to standing and walking around all day. It literally, like, my body is more sad on a day where I've sat all day. I promise you, my body is more sad about s sitting. I'm just so used to standing and walking at work. Yeah, yeah. I've gotten pretty into a game before, but I've never got, like... I, I don't know what, what game was the most hard for me to pull myself away from, but... Not enough for me to even kind of come close to comparing it to killing myself for it. Oh, there you go, we got it. For oh my god, we're getting some serious... Oh my god, it's a big floor. We're gonna make some mine in progress now. I don't know how big this mine is, but... Still on bronze, so not far enough. Holy cow. Okay. I just wanna exhaust what's in this room and then get out of here. Actually, I didn't really come here intending to go down another five, but. Oh, well, I will. I'm, oh my god. I like to take the free floor, but. Oh, I like how all the creatures can jump everything. is important to be active every now and then. Yeah, I mean, if I had to stand up that, so if I actually did sit here for way too long, well, in theory, I could stand up all the time. Like, if I, if I work, sit down and work a lot more this week, I will be standing up at some point at this computer. Like, you stand still at work a lot, like, like at first your feet and make your knees bother you, but then like it doesn't anymore. Like right, and then, uh, I mean unless you like one day you're going super fast, but like, but then if I sit at work all now it's like my back. Like not not today. Like I feel fine today, but after a few days of just sitting at work, my back will be like so sad. I know it's a posture thing, I guess, but like, it's so weird to say like you're using muscles that you're not using when you're talking about sitting. I don't know when you. I don't know. I spend like ten hours of the day standing and walking, like, and then all of a sudden I'm sitting. It's not agreeable to me. Spider fur or something. That, I don't know how much it's worth, but we're gonna find out. That's how you do. It. Oh, it, oh, it's summer tomorrow. In summer. Uh, I want to go make. One, we're gonna go try to do the compost too while we're over here. So that's so we can fertilize as much as we can. Can I make a beehive or do I need one more? Okay, then I guess I'm not going to. All right, tomorrow's summer. Oh, I should check for honey. Crap. Oh, well. I'll be okay. Next date.